Hey everyone, thanks for watching. This is going to be a quick video on how to calibrate your glucometer. So the things that you're going to need is, of course, your glucometer. This is a One Touch Ultra. It's a pretty common glucometer out there. You will need your control solution. So of course it should be the brand that matches your glucometer. And according to your instructions, you should put the expiration date according to um, what it says in the paper that comes inside of there. For this one, it says that you should discard it three months after opening. So you'll want to take note of the date that you opened it and put a sticker or write on there with a Sharpie of when the expiration date of your control solution is. You don't want to use an expired control solution. You're going to get inaccurate results when you're calibrating your glucometer. And then you're going to want your test strips. So again, with your test strips, you should have the expiration date written on there. It will have the control range of what your results should be. So as you can see, this one, it's going to expire September 17th. Our control range is going to be 122 to 165. That's the result that you are going to want to expect. So let's get started. You're gonna get a strip out of there. You're going to put that in to the glucometer. It's gonna turn on. Now I set that down flat. Then with your control solution, give it a quick shake. It should show you the instructions on the side. Shake well store below a certain temperature. You don't want it to get too hot when your glucometer is beeping, saying it's ready for a drop of blood. In this case, it's the control solution. You're going to apply that drop into the test strip. It's going to count down. Five, four, three, two, one. It's going to give you the result. So I always take the test strip out, 146. And then you're going to write that down and is it within the range of what you are expecting. So it is between 122 to 165 and that's what you expect. And that is pretty much how you will calibrate your glucometer. Let me know if you have any questions and I'll get back to you. Uh, feel free to give me a thumbs up or subscribe if this video was helpful and we'll have more videos coming. Thank you.